Danny, it's the first away game of the new season. What's your thoughts ahead of the game? Yeah, um, great place to go. Fantastic pitch. Um, they've started well, obviously. Um, as we mentioned before, we've got we've got some really interesting fixtures, the first sort of 10, 11 games. So, yeah, we're excited for the challenge. We, it, the pitch will suit us in the way we want to play. So, yeah, no, I think um, we, we, we know what Bourne would bring to the table. So we're looking forward to the challenge. Because, of course, the first game saw us play Chesterfield and it was unfortunate to know defeat. But obviously it's important to reflect on that and move on to the next game. How do you reflect on the game against Chesterfield? As I said in the post-match, I think there's a lot of positives to take out of the game um, up until the penalty. I thought we gave us... Look, did, did we create um, loads of chances and did they get away with one? I don't think so. I thought it was a very tight affair and I think over the course of the 90 minutes, if we'd have drawn the game, no one could have argued with it. Um, I think sometimes people misinterpret what you say when you say you, you're in the game. Um, I think from our perspective, with the level of kind of aspirations of what Chester would have got this season I thought we gave a very good account of ourselves and it was unfortunate that a game was going to be lost based on a decision that in my opinion and, and, and that of quite a few was wrong so it was it was really important that we made sure the lads focused on the positives out of the game um, and we built, it, we built on that this week hopefully to take that into the to the Boreham Wood game Just a quick note on on the injury front obviously George came off half time so he had a bit of a, a tight Muscle by the looks at the end of the game, both how are they doing and how are the boys who are recovering doing as well? Yeah, everyone's on track. So we've, we've still got a little bit of work to do today. We haven't left the training grounds yet, so we've still got a little bit of work to do today. And yeah, fingers crossed that everyone who was available Saturday should be available tomorrow. Because, of course, with Bournemouth, Wood, it sees us play our player from last season, player of the season, uh, Josh Reese. Bit of an interesting, a bit of interesting conversation to have there. Yeah, he, he knows. He knows. He knows about us. He knows what we're what we're like. He knows what we're trying to do. Different personnel this year, so look, I mean, look, it'd be good to see him. Um, but our four focus is on Bowen Wood as a side, not on Josh. Because of course, last season when we were there, it was just their fans. It was a bit of a hectic game that, again, unfortunately, saw us lose three two in the last few minutes. But again, it was a good game for us to be involved in, and we'll be looking to to hopefully come away with a win on, on Saturday. Yeah, it'd be good to have our supporters there. And I mean, the bottom line for us is, is as I said, it's building on what we 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 did very well for sort of 65, 70 minutes on Saturday, building on that and and obviously trying to create more of a threat in the, in, in the other penalty area. And if we do that, we know that we're capable of beating anybody. And of course, just finally on Boreham Wood, they come in with a 2-0 victory against Weymouth last time out for them. So they'll be going into the game of confidence. Yeah, and I, Luke's a very experienced manager at this level and he, he always puts out very competitive teams and his, his recruitment's good as well. And I think from our perspective, you know what you're going to get when you go there. You're gonna, you, you have to be at your best because if you're not, they, 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 will, they can do what to anybody what they did to Weymouth on Saturday. So, um, yeah, we, it, as, as we always say, H, the, the, the level of teams in this league are very tough and it, it is going to be a tough day at the office. But... You know what, it's a, it's a challenge that we, we thrive on, so looking forward to it. Because that, of course, comes with the mentality that you and, you know, Kins and Kev all spoke about, is, you know, going in with no fear and hopefully competing against these top clubs in this league. We, we, we shouldn't have any fear. We've got very, very good players in our building and that are working extremely hard every day. Is that going to mean that we're going to be able to win every game this season? Of course not. I don't think any team will do that. Is it? Does it give us the optimism that we can go and compete with every team in this league, then yes, I believe it does. So, and and you're always going to have off days. You're always going to have bad days at the office. There's always going to be decisions go your way. But there's a positive mantra around the squad that we back ourselves to go and win football matches. And that will start with another game tomorrow. Are you in the shop? Sign up below. Click here for the next video and click here to subscribe. Oh.